like to show you how effective a primary triad is in creating chromatic greys. A primary triad is formed by red, yellow and blue. When the triad is well balanced, chosen colours are capable of creating an impressive range of mixtures. I'm using Windsor Lemon, Cadmium Red and Ultramarine Blue. The colours are rather raw and brash, so I'm going to start by mixing a black. I'll start with blue as it is the weakest in pigmentation and will add very little red and yellow relative to this. Adding white to a portion of the mix will show up any leaning towards a primary or secondary which can be adjusted by adding the opposite or complementary colour. Each colour has a mixture of the other two as the complementary and it's a two-way relationship. This mixture leans towards violet, so I'll add yellow to get it more neutral. From this point, I can divide the mixture up and experiment. Adding yellow and red to the mix will push it towards brown. Adding just yellow will push it towards green. Now I'll take the green and add some white to it. And some of my original black. And add some red. And some white. It's amazing, but everything on this panel has been made with this particular triad of red, yellow and blue, combined with white. By limiting the choice, the process becomes intuitive, and you'll soon be able to create the chromatic greys you'll encounter when working from observation, and also equivalents to core colours like yellow ochre, burnt sienna and burnt umber that will harmonise perfectly with more vivid mixes. Thank you.